fuck are you doing? We weren't done conversing. Call that a conversation. Not your plowing business. You need a smack us on it.
she, her ears. She elf. And everyone knows elves are always doing something on the sly. I'm not doing anything, I swear it. I must just fetch some water. Where will you put it? Where's your jug, eh? Where's your bucket? Leave her be. By what right are you giving me orders, eh? Let's go, Reddy. Killing's like batting an eye for witchmen. You can breathe. It's over. Over? Nothing I can do about... Then why get involved at all? You didn't scare those balls off. Go, Vatgern. Sit down. You beat them. I never lied a few. 
finger on Tamara. Not once. And on Anna? That's another story. She always knew how to spark my ire. You knew they had run away from the start? Yes, I knew. Why didn't you tell me? Wasted my time. Say I had. Say I'd said I had troubles. Couldn't control my wife, my daughter. What kind of flaccid prick would you take me for? Tell me everything you remember about the day they fled. The truth this time. I'd been soaking myself three days straight. Anna came to me, said they were leaving. I begged them to stay. She refused to hear it. I tried to stop her. She wriggled like an eel. We struggled. She fell. Last blasted thing I remember. Woke up in the morn, breeches heavy with my own piss. A large bump on my head. Sadly, they were gone. Know what that's like, Witcher? No. How the fuck could you? I was left with nothing. Nothing! Only the bottle. What happened next? Next? It only got worse. I awoke at sunset, not knowing how many days had passed. I thought it was all a plowing, drunken nightmare. And then I went to the bedchamber, and Anna was not there. Instead, there was blood everywhere. I knew. She'd miscarried. My breath short, my throat locked. I neared the bed. And saw it. It lay there. Tiny thing, defenseless, on blooded sheets, dead. And it was my doing. Maybe you're doing, maybe not. But that amulet she wore could be important. Or maybe the fact that she lost it. What did you do with the child? What was I to do? Took it out and buried it. Just like that. Damn you! I gave no thought to a funeral. It was a horror. I wanted it to end. That child had been my dream. I told Anna, the little one, our little one, to make things right. Yet she died before she could be born. Understand, Witcher. My child was dead. Get a hold of yourself. Men like you, when they break down, look downright pathetic. You're a heartless bastard. Huh. Mutations worked then. But here's the good news. Your dead child might help us find the one who's still alive. And your wife. What? How? Sometimes miscarried fetuses, if they don't get a proper burial, turn into botchlings. Into... fucking what? A cursed creature that draws strength from killing pregnant women. Once it's strong enough, it attacks those who scorned it. But how? How does it know? Blood ties. They're a strong bond. A bond I want to use to find your family. How? One of two ways. Legends claim you can bury a botchling under the family's threshold, perform a ritual and turn it into a lubberkin. That's a sort of, uh, hob. A guardian spirit that could lead me to your family. And the other way? We kill it and draw some blood. Take that to the Peller and he does the rest. Do not kill my child. It's suffered enough already. Lift the curse that it may finally rest in peace. Whatever we do, we gotta find the botchling first. I'll show you where I buried her. And I'll dig the grave at my threshold. If it turns out we can't transform the botchling into a lubricant, they can bury us in it, handy either way. The sooner we resolve this, the better. Best do it tonight, at midnight. 
Then wait here with me. Near midnight, I'll take you to where I buried her. Get word to the common folk. Let us stay in their homes tonight and draw a line of salt outside their doors. And try to sober up. Do I take a shuffle? So dig up the grave? Take it. You'll need it, but not for that. further follow me